So we were charged to do a, a new bakery, a conversion of an old restaurant to a bakery, an old Carl's Jr. fast food facility in Walnut Creek, existing but shut down, lease is expired, and our, one of our clients who does uh, a lot of cooking and bakery work decided to lease the space. So they pretty much were taking the space as is with some work that needed to be done. We had the original drawings done by computer, CAD as we know it, uh, in 97 with an older version of we don't know what. Um, no one has the computer files, uh, which is fascinating because a lot of clients, particularly chains, want things done in CAD for future reuse. But getting them and finding them is always interesting and in this case, nowhere to be found. Cities and jurisdictions do not have copies of them. They still keep hard copies. And if we're lucky, they scan those and microfilm them if we're lucky, even though we pay for that process when we get a building permit. So the bottom line is CAD files, like warranty paper at home, gets lost and shuffled and is never to be found again. So uh, for us to delve into the CAD drawings and uh, edit them, if you will, for this new bakery, which is a very simple change from old to new with finishes being changed, is not impossible, but extremely impractical. And uh, in fact, using CAD to do it is even more so to get into even a file that's current and make the edits is unnecessary and very time consuming. So with scanning technology, which has reached a, a, a high platform today where we're able to scan large drawings of any type in color or not, um, with things glued on, cut and paste, basically a collage of material. The process was quite simple. It met the client's budget, who, of course, didn't want to do anything to convert an old building to a new use when there were very few changes, but that's, those are the rules. So we have to go through the process with agencies and how to do drawings. So the bottom line here is um, using technology, or in this case, not, when the situation applies, and I think today as architects and engineers and our whole profession has lost somewhat the sense of what needs to be done when trying to get a message across. That's our job is to communicate information technical. It doesn't have to be done in a particular computer software to get there. So the drawings that we have here are, there's two fold sets of drawings. One is the original um, Carl's Jr. set of drawings, which uh, believe it or not, it looks like old blueprints uh, because they were. Uh, at the time this was done, the computers were available to do things, but the technology for plotting and copying and printing wasn't as large. We were still doing blueprinting. That technology has pretty much gone away. And what we're doing today, for lack of a better phrase, is we're doing large printing like large Xerox output with rolls of paper. And uh, so they're white, not blue. And uh, what you see here in black is an exact copy of the blue that you've seen in the old set. So it was scanned and printed. And the architect took a red flare and denoted all the, quote, revisions and changes and description of work that's needed to go from what was there or is out there today existing in black to the red notes. And you can see that there's not a lot of red notes, quite simple, quite fast, very efficient. After this was done, this red set, red denoted set was scanned again, printed, and we used it for permit submittal. Uh, the client is using it for pricing to do the work, and it went very fast. No rebuttal from the agencies. Um, they don't have criteria for CAD. They don't have criteria for text being typed or done in a certain font, they want the information that's legible, just as a contractor does, just as a client does. So there it is, uh, old technology that still works and efficient and does the job when it's needed to be done. And that's a decision that should always be made when putting a project into production. Uh, James Reyes, uh, we're in the taco side of Denica's Pastry Cafe, which is now Denica's Real Food Kitchen, incorporated into one restaurant. Uh, we've been at this location for approximately uh, 14 years, and we've been have the bakery aspect since 1987. Uh, Walnut Creek is a uh, fully untapped market for what we do, is, which is quick serve breakfast and lunch um, with a taco flair to it.